and get one. Hey everyone! Hey. <laughs> so we are at the movies right now with Noah and we are watching Beckett Ralph. So Beckett Ralph actually comes out on November 21st but today is the 20th and just like just so happened I was at work and I was looking for um, show times for tomorrow and they had show times for tonight. So it is a 10.40 viewing and it's a really, it's a really full theater um, but that way we can also do the Beckett Ralph Void tomorrow. If we can get to get to time, um, but we're Shouts really excited. Out. Yeah. Shout out to Noah's parents for watching. Thank you. Shout out to Noah's parents. Hi mom. Our number one, our number one fans. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So it is 12 something right now. We just got out of our movie and reviews. I don't know. It's I liked cool. it. Loved it. Yeah. It was, like they had. A, it was really good. It was really good. They had a lot of like cute little. Um, what did they what did it call that? Easter eggs? Yeah, yeah, like Easter eggs slash like little like um puns. Puns slash what is the like social media inputs? Trends. Trends trends, exactly. Trends <laughs> in it. Um so that was pretty cool. Really it was good. good. It was really good. Watch them. Yeah. <laughs> So here at Disney Springs, they have the virtual reality. Um, we did the Star Wars because it's no, it's normally just Star Wars. So we did the Void, which that's what the thing is called. So because of Wreck-It Ralph, they came out with a Wreck-It Ralph version of it, and so that starts officially tomorrow. So we're gonna go ahead and do that tomorrow since we watched the movie tonight, even though it comes out tomorrow. Anyways, I mean like the movie was really good. Even our, like our crowd was really good. <laughs> You guys are so weird. <laughs> uh, the crowd was really good. Like they were like cheering when like the good parts came on and like booing and crying and all those other good things. Honest though, I thought it could have been better. Ooh. I thought it could have been better. I thought like there was more of like a, a climax and more of a conclusion. It's hard because the Disney scene is so good. Especially with all like the Disney freaks in the theater with us tonight. Yeah, I guess. That that was like the peak of the movie and then the whole ending part wasn't as good, but it was still good. Yeah. Yeah. Crowd is good though. I don't know, I think I might like record oh, the, the first one the <laughs> anyway. <better. laughs> this is the end of the video. <laughs> okay. And we're gonna do the void tomorrow. But for now, good night. Hi everyone, so it is the next day. We watched Wreck-It Ralph last night and we're here at Disney Springs tonight. However, the void is sold out for Wreck-It Ralph. And the reason why I didn't get it online was because we get our cast member discount. So I was gonna do it in person and they're sold out for the night. So we're on our way back to the void so that we can schedule a time for tomorrow. That way we already have our time, we have our tickets and there's no chance of them selling out. It's also very crowded today and I think it's just because of um, Thanksgiving week so there's just like more people this week it's a peak week for the park um, and it's also a little bit chilly although these guys are in t-shirts and shorts so we just got our time for tomorrow night which is gonna be 10 p.m. and as we we're buying our tickets he gave us it's so cute these little Ralph buttons and if you haven't seen the movie yet um, two of these characters are new. What's the names of the characters? Um, yes. Yeah. And Gal Gadot. I don't know her. I don't know her, yeah. her character name. Um, Shank. Shank. That's right. So yes and Shank. And then they also give you a just like regular Wreck It Ralph breaks. Oh wait. There you go. Wreck It Ralph breaks the internet button. If it will focus. We have our time for tomorrow, and then I, we also got our cast member discount. And I'm out of focus. <laughs> the camera so this is my phone um, we just checked in for our Wreck-It Ralph experience also happy Thanksgiving um, so they gave us this lanyard and we got to pick out a card I got this yellow girl pretty cool and then we also get the wristbands you also get this for the Star Wars boy but it's just like a wristband it's 9.50 right now and our experience is at 10 so kind of early but um, there's not really a line like how there was for Star Wars. And then yesterday when Nua and I came, Nua, uh, there was a fat line outside with like at least 20 to 30 people. So we're happy we came the second day. And it's only the second day too, so it's good. All right, again, so this is my car. Uh, they have 
three different types of like female cards and three different types of male cards. This is what I got. And then on the back it says my favorite social media site combines dating with paid mix match martial, martial arts. And a pro tip for mine is shoot stuff till it blows up, then shoot stuff that blew up. Kalei got the purple one, and it's this guy. Um, I'm a soundcloud rapper. Yeah. <laughs> Um, and this one says my music is just is so far out that it's in, and I haven't found my online audience yet. And then his pro tip is, you'll be a programmer's hero when more bugs, hero the more bugs you squash. Well, that's cool. And then Noah's is this like surfer dude with the sunscreen on his nose, and here's what the back says. When I'm like riding a gnarly fiber optic wave, it's awesome surfing the web, dude. And then his pro tip is choosing the right cuisine can make a difference in a food fight. So, and then there's three other three other type of cards besides these ones, but obviously there's only three of us. So, yeah. so reviews. Me? Yeah, we're like. Everyone. Um, it was really cool. I really liked it, but I like Star Wars too much for it to be better than Star Wars. Yeah. Plus, it was our second time. It didn't have that same wall effect. That's true. But it's still really good. Yeah. Well, what did you think? I really liked it. I thought it was cool. I think it's better than Star Wars. <laughs> <laughs> Keep in mind, he hasn't done the Star Wars one yet. Yeah, yeah that was his first so, time. <laughs> um, yeah, it was good. Um, I liked how fast it was because for Star Wars, we waited maybe like four, 30 to 40 minutes to get into the room and then get changed and then the experience. So like all together, it was like an hour, hour and a half. This one, we were in and out in like... 25 minutes mm -hmm. like super super fast so I like that um, there's also like things in this v experience that um, aren't in Star Wars even though it's like the the same not like layout oh yeah like the same layout if you if, yeah if you've done virtual reality before then you kind of like understand but it was super cool um, watching the movie before going to that made it cooler it made it cooler, but at the same time if you didn't watch the movie I don't think it would have mattered yeah yeah, yeah like it, it was relevant but not enough I guess yeah not too it wasn't too bad much. um yeah so with our cast member discount it came out to $34 per person I think that was regular price anyways I don't know who, I don't, who knows maybe <laughs> we're still doing the Star Wars one so yep. if you want to do the Star Wars one you can do the Star Wars one we gotta take note to do the Star Wars one because we like the Star Wars one um tomorrow night Ugh. We gotta get our paychecks first. <laughs> <laughs> Next Thursday. We need money. We need money. So thank you guys for watching. This is our review for Wrecker of the movie and the Void Experience, and it was really fun. Like we love Wrecker Ralph, so it was good. You guys should definitely watch it, check it out, and do the Void because they have it here in Orlando, Las Vegas. I think they have one in LA. Las Vegas, LA. Yeah, I think so. They have a couple wow. locations everywhere except Hawaii. So <laughs> sorry to our Hawaii friends, but uh, yeah, thank you guys for watching. See you later. Shoo.